Yo, what is it good, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Hopefully, you guys are having an awesome day for only positive vibes. For those who don't know, the other day I was 1v1ing Bobby with shotguns. He decided to pull out the HSO and I used the BY-50. And I honestly hate the HSO. For those who don't know what happened, I'll show you guys some clips of what happened. Ooh, wow. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be real, I did not expect that to happen. Wow! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. The HSO might be the best shotgun in the game. So as you guys saw, I got destroyed by the HSO. I was super shocked that he was consistently killing me within that 10 meter range with the ADS build. And that got me thinking, what if the HSO is really underrated and a lot of people don't know about it? So today, we decided to try it out. And oh my goodness, this shotgun has probably the best ADS spread accuracy build I've ever seen. And you, you won't believe why. I'll explain it to you guys at the end, but you guys will watch the video and you will understand. But guys, it was absolutely insane. Don't want to keep you guys here too much longer. All this is going to be from my live stream, trovo.live slash dhitman or youtube.com slash dhitman live for a spin comment. All right, see you guys at the end. I'll use a shotgun on this map. I'm going to use... Do I use the HS2126? Do you guys want to see the bird shotgun or you guys want to see the HSO? Low key though. ADS accuracy. Oh my god, he's hitting me shoot! That's pretty insane, I'm not gonna lie. Wait. I know HP. My movement was scuffed on that fight. It's awkward, but right. My scuffness was nice. My movement was awkward. Awkward as heck. I thought I would swore, but no, not today. I'm pushing back to the main point. All right, yes, I might get hit here, but I don't care less. No, I did not potato that shot. There's a sniper here. Gonna get it. Bop. Bop. Couldn't grab these spikes. What a blue is hiding. Huh. Oh, nice shot, Lur. Hostile have the hard point. I'm pushing real good. My teammate is out there, not doing no. That was pretty nice, actually. Don't know how I got that kill. Let's see if we can get this enemy here. Huh. 
Yo, that was easy. They're on the back, right? Wait. Wait. I got them all. Go for the bop. I bopped that entire team off the point. Well, that was a GG. Who would have known ADS spread accuracy shock and felt this one felt so consistent. It's sad to say, but I learned this from losing to Bobby. <laughs> I'm glad we had someone play OBJ that whole game. That was good. All right, that loadout. So it's really much a ADS spread accuracy build. Um, I believe it's very similar to the one. I don't know if Bobby used this exact build. The main thing is the RTC um, extended. We're using a choke. We're using the rear granulated, and we're using a tactical laser. Potentially, I would I would have loved to use the soft. I think it's the better attachment, but on this one, it doesn't work well because there's only seven bullets. So going down to four, just not manageable. We have the laser sight here. We have the granulated. And we have the no stock. Uh, potentially speaking, you can make this a little bit better by taking off the no stock and putting the strike grip. But I wanted the mobility, so this is the build that we have. Uh, the reason this build works so well is I'll actually show it to you guys for a second because I didn't know this until like literally when I was testing this out like the other day. You guys may not notice, okay? So five meter, you're taking a bullet shot. You're like, oh, that's just that's just two bullets in the middle, right? You're like, oh, okay. And then you go up here, you go to ten meters, and you're like, oh. Three bullets? Wait, there's three bullets? So if there's three bullets, that means you're most likely not gonna hit marker at 10 meters, which is insane. It's the most consistent. All right, that's it for today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about the HSO. I would have loved this gun to have eight base bullet rather than the seven, I think it's base, because then I would be able to use the low light barrel or whatever saw barrel it's called. That would have made this gun so much better just because it has so, such a better advantage using that in my opinion, obviously, but at last it didn't have that opportunity. So that kind of sucks because four bullets is just not enough. But let me know what you guys think. All right, I'm out. See you guys next time. Kill it.